So we've got the motor home on the road and we've realised after travelling about 2,000 kilometres with a couple of motorbikes on the back and a whole bunch of water tanks that the back end is sagging down. So to maintain your ride height and bring your back end back up to a nice level ride, we've come to the airbag men at Strathpine, just north of Brisbane, Queensland, Australia. We're going to fit up some airbags to bring up the height of the vehicle, shoot along, we'll be flying on air. So you might not have a whole bunch of bikes on the back like we've got on this motor home, but you might have a whole lot of gear in the back and it's weighing your back end down and you've got to maintain your height and bring it back up to a nice level ride. What the airbag man guys will do is give you a kit to suit your vehicle. They've got a whole bunch of kits, 400 in fact, and they can raise and maintain that height so your vehicle can shoot along the road, you'll be riding on air, it's all good to go. Heaps and heaps and heaps of these airbags, rows and rows and rows of these guys, all packed up, ready to go. When you ring up an order and they send them out and kit all the boxes of weight so you specifically get what you want. They're all quality insured. These things are tough fire stone airbags. They go underneath your vehicle, they hold it up and get that ride height sitting nice and stable for you. So what does an airbag look like? Well this is an airbag here. There's a whole bunch of different types to suit all the vehicles. This is the type that's going to go in the Toyota Coaster. They're tough little suckers. The guys are working on them out the back here. They're not going to stop rain, hail or shine going to get the height of that bus leveled out so we can head on down the highway cruise along without doing any wheel stands you can load all your gear up in the back and it's going to steady out your ride now in the early days of African safaris this is what you got around in in the old Land Rovers to take you anywhere any place this is an old beauty now what we're doing now is we've got the coaster motorhome out there and we're going to modernize it and bring it up to one of the best rides you can get in town for this day and age They've got heaps of room, they've also got the good horse and all the gear to put in any sort of vehicle and get it up in the air. The airbags will go for anything, even semi-trailer trucks, these bags will hold them all up and keep them going for you. To get them on here in the back, they're a noisy bunch, we're going to fit the airbags in the vehicle now. It's good to know the airbag man is an Australian company and a family business with over 400 different types of airbags to suit to fit the vehicles. are in the vehicle, how do they get them to go up and come down and how do they adjust and all the rest of it? Well, what you're fitting is a compressor and or sometimes you need an air tank as well to give it that extra oomph. And then the vehicle can be raised up and down, you can go from front to rear. And what does that mean as a motorhome? It means you can level your vehicle to an extent by left and right. You know, leveling out your vehicle when you set up your swag and that, and front to rear as well. Here's some of the goodies in the cabinet here in the showroom at the airbag. Man, let's have a quick peek at these. You've got your gauges down there. So you've got that one there, this is for the two airbags at the back, so you've got left and rear so we can go up and down and adjust its PSI which will adjust its height. And there's some compressors there as well, we've got air tanks over here with all the gadgets and there's a super big compressor and all the gear. And a whole lot of other stuff that I don't understand but I know it works really simple. So we want to put our airbags up when we're travelling along, lift at the back end, we just simply get in the front of the cab here and up she goes. When we get to the site that we're going to stay at we want to bring the back end back down or level it out right side down left side down both sides down we've had the airbags on for a while now from the airbag man in fact we're all the way down in Tasmania what we found is when we had all the gear in the back of the uh, vehicle it was low down in the back end and we were standing along the highway well now what we've got is we've actually got about 70 psi out of these airbags here and it's lifting the back end up all nicely. As you can see now there's a nice big gap there between the wheel and the guard whereas before that guard was sitting right down there. So now the bikes are sitting up nice and high. They're not dragging along the road like a, like a sack of bricks. And it's riding really nice like we're floating on air.